Lethal Weapon star Clayne Crawford out as producers scramble to recast the Warner Brothers. Television drama could potentially return for a third season if the co-lead can be quickly replaced. Fox and producers are scrambling to save Lethal Weapon. Multiple sources tell The Hollywood Reporter that troubled star Clayne Crawford has been fired from the Fox procedural and studio Warner Brothers. Television has been scrambling to find an actor to replace him. Sources say multiple actors have been offered the role for a potential third season and have passed as the process continues ahead of Fox's upfront presentation to Madison Avenue ad buyers. On Monday, Fox and WBTV declined comment. Crawford has come under fire of late for his bad behavior on the set of the Damon Wayans drama. The actor recently apologized for two incidents for which he was reprimanded during the sophomore season. Crawford said the first incident happened when he became angry with what he deemed unsafe working conditions on the set. After the outburst, the actor said he met with human resources, apologized for his role in the conflict and completed studio-appointed therapy, while also sharing a sizable portion of his paycheck with one of the parties involved at Warner's request. The second incident occurred during an episode Crawford was directing when another actor on set felt unsafe after being hit by a piece of shrapnel from an effect. I absolutely love, respect and care for my crew and cast and would never intentionally jeopardize so many jobs, Crawford wrote. I am incredibly sorry if my passion for doing good work has ever made anyone feel less than comfortable on our set, or feel less than celebrated for their efforts. Furthermore, I apologize to all the crew and cast for any negative attention Lethal Weapon is receiving because of these incidents. Crawford's behavior has left Lethal Weapon, one of Fox's better performing dramas, on the bubble as many connected with the series have said they would rather not work with the actor. Fox and Warner Brothers. Television have until June 30, when options on the cast expire, to make a decision on the future of the series, but would prefer to do so before Monday's upfront presentation. Network insiders are currently mulling the fate of multiple comedy and drama pilots as they piece together their 2018-19 schedule. Fox needs a new rigs, according to The Hollywood Reporter. The network has fired Clayne Crawford from its Lethal Weapon TV adaptation and is looking to recast his role with a new actor in order to pick up the show for a third season. Crawford was reportedly fired for creating a toxic work environment with his behavior on set, which was previously reported a few weeks ago. Crawford admitted to being reprimanded for two incidents on the set of the show in a note online. It was later reported that his co-star, Damon Wayans, who plays Murtaugh, was not speaking to Crawford after one of those incidents. Lethal Weapon is well in the ratings and would likely be a shoe-in for a renewal were it not for this sunset turmoil. According to THR, the network has reached out to several actors to replace Crawford already, who have passed on the part. Lethal Weapon star Clayne Crawford who has been at the center of controversy after some on-set behavioral issues were flagged, has responded to reports that he will be fired from the Fox show should it be renewed for a third season. It has been rumored that Fox is searching for a new Martin Riggs to replace Klain. However, they have yet to find an actor who will accept the role. With a third season still uncertain for the show, a recast is of utmost importance at this time. Klain's onset behavior was flagged recently when reports of his anger and outbursts over workplace safety were making his fellow cast and crew members uneasy. It was also reported that Crawford's co-star Damon Wayans was injured by flying shrapnel from an effect during an episode that Crawford was directing. 
At the time, Crawford addressed the controversy on his Instagram, confirming that there had been unsaid issues over working conditions that did not feel safe or conducive to good work under the leadership of a guest director and assistant director. He confirmed that he met with HR and even completed studio-appointed therapy. He went on to further apologize to cast and crew while stating how much he loved his job and how he hoped his fans would stick with him. No mention of his future with the series had been mentioned at that time. After rumors began circulating that Crawford would be replaced should the show be renewed for a third season, the actor once again took to social media to comment, posting a picture of himself with his arms thrown in the air in a who knows pose. He then addressed the rumors of his firing. When everyone seems to know your future but you, no word from Fox or Warner Brothers. I hope I'm not fired. Dang. While multiple sources have confirmed the firing, it seems that no one has bothered to tell Klain.